Hey guys, Shinesaur here, and welcome to my top 5 best character combos in Overwatch video. In Overwatch, there are some characters that synergize really well with each other, and this is my personal opinion of the 5 best combos. Number 5, McCree and Reinhardt. You might be thinking, doesn't Reinhardt work better with Soldier? Because Soldier's just a better character? Well, yeah, maybe, but in my opinion, I just prefer Reinhardt with McCree because Deadeye is such a bad ultimate, but you can actually get value out of it if you protect your McCree with that giant blue shield. And also, if you guys just watch each other's back, like Reinhardt, he could just shield him, so McCree could just get free damage. And McCree, if Reinhardt's being pinned, he could just stop the pin with a flash ping. And it's just a beautiful combo that works really well. And if you guys haven't tried it that way, I advise you get into a duo queue and you try it out with your friend. Moving on to number four, we have... This one, it's not really a duo, so it's a little cheating, but it's cheating a little, but whatever. It's just too good not to include. We have Reinhardt, Bastion, and Mercy. I know you guys played this before, and you guys probably rage quit against this team because it's especially really overpowered in lower ranks. And it could sometimes work in the higher ranks, but it takes a lot of like teamwork, and first you need three people to agree to play this cheese comp. And basically, Reinhardt just holds his shield up 24-7 for you. Mercy just pockets you, just leaves, lets everybody else die because you only need three people to carry the team. And then, ba 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 you win. Moving on to number three, we have Zarya and Tracer. So Zarya and Tracer is really good because for, when it comes to choke points, if you guys want to push in, Tracer the flanker. Genshi could also work, but I feel like Tracer works better, but... You bubble the tracer, she runs in, she gets a bunch of kills, like she flanks the supports or the DPS, and then your team pushes in. Also, this is not even mentioning Zarya's ultimate and how well it synergizes with tracers. Yeah, Zarya's ultimate works really well with pretty much every offensive ultimate in the game, but I feel it works the, works the best with Tracer because she gets her ultimate so fast, it's one of the fastest ultimates in the game, so she could use like her pulse bomb like three times or two times before. Zarya even gets her Graviton Surge, and then once you do, it's just you tag someone in there and boom, team kill. I know the gameplay is terrible because I suck with Tracer and Zarya, so we just use bots and it's still terrible, but whatever. Moving on to number two, we have Anna and Reinhardt. Anna and Reinhardt is overpowered because every team uses it. I'm pretty sure you've seen every single team in the world use Ana and Reinhardt. It's probably because they're both meta but also their ultimate synergize really well because you guys already know season 3 or season 2, I don't remember what season it was, nano boost used to make you faster so Reinhardt nano was just broken but it doesn't do that anymore but it's still really good because he could still pin something like 600 health and kill him with one pin and his fire strike does like 200 plus damage. And it swings to an incredible amount of damage. It's just broke. It's just broken. Please, just try this. If you're not trying this, you're never going to win in comp. I can promise you that. And moving on to our final number one. is Farah and Mercy. Far Mercy. Man. Not even much to say on this one. It's just broken as hell. Basically, your Farah just carries and the mercy just helps her carry you just power her up and she does so much damage you heal her up it's just incredibly busted in the gameplay you can see i'm even destroying the team and i suck with Farah, and that just shows you how broken it is and also unless you have freaking pro widowmaker on your team on the enemy team you're probably not gonna die because most people think it's so simple you just pick soldier or you pick McCree and you kill them but it's not that hard it's not that simple because you have to actually worry about if she's going up down right left it's just so hard to hit her and also she, when she, you do hit her she just gets healed up it's a team effort to take down a farmer see basically basically and that's my top five video I hope you guys enjoy this video if you do Make sure to slap the like button and subscribe if you aren't if you aren't already. And until next time, Shine Source signing off.